have two engine because there is literally no wind but we open an exception since it has been a very long day of really really little wind you happy that we are arriving the taco is arriving sorry what Yes, there will be taco tonight. Ah, it's celebration taco. After a quick pit stop in La Paz to pick up our friends and mix some gasoline at a dark corner of the road, we started exploring the Sea of Cortes. We anchored in Caleta Lobos and came for a hike. The coolest thing is that we didn't really expect to be a particularly nice hike. We just wanted to hike for the sake of hiking. But then this turns to be the Miradouro of the Bahia Balandra, which is absolutely fantastic. someone who's not doing six knots. Our competitor boat, which has better sails, is doing 3.7. <laughs> The marine life in the Sea of Cortes is absolutely stunning. We saw humpback whales and flying rays nearly every day. And here we got particularly lucky. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> this really gives uh, we're in the middle of nowhere vibes. Isn't it? This island, I think it's uninhabited. I can't imagine anybody living here. You good with this anchor, Jalana? Yeah, sounds amazing. Looks amazing. Lola, what did you see today? Oh, so many things. That was insane! What was your favorite part of the day, Jason? The fucking well. Sorry, that ruined the video. Pelicans from. As soon as it starts flapping, you can release. Okay, you're good. And then there will be served right now. Scrooby the bum bum. So today we check out the armas and the conditions of them. You can see is that they are quite spacious. The only bad thing is, but you can see the wood going away. On certain places like this, this fuzzy little wood, and to get rid of that or to make this part solid again, we're gonna use Smith epoxy. We can see this area quite clear here. This was probably all wet at one point, and it's tempting to take more and more off, but I think it's not too smart to do that. So, I'm really only using this brush to get the top pieces off. Maybe give 
it's good tinder for fire oh, yeah. magical smith this is the secret man we have been talking about <laughs> Not the easiest working combinations, super liquid, should always be brushed from underneath the top, however. Not a beautiful morning in a beautiful bay, but today is project day. Sabatingi will finally get the rudder after losing it. Another day on Mindelo. Happy Easter, Easter Sunday. And this man knows no holiday. Want to say happy Easter to your <laughs> friends and followers? Happy, happy Easter, Easter, everyone. Easter. That's why we came together here in this national park. <laughs> in this national park. <laughs> Beautiful, quiet, most of the time, but to connect the rudder blade with the tiller, we're gonna cut out oh, yes. the thickness of the tiller out of here. Battery of the Starlock is in charging mode, but this biceps is not. It's a radar, it's a radar. Da -da -da. With a short A. Ooh, doesn't fish. this beautiful beach the captain is swimming snorkeling stand up paddling oh no sorry the captain is working he's redoing the sail lazy bag meanwhile jason is having fun no i'm working really hard yeah look look at me his lung <laughs> What is happening, Nick? Well, <laughs> one person swimming and another person on a stand-up paddle. Drifting away. <laughs> so, we have a situation. Alana thought that she could paddle against wind. And it seems like she cannot, so she's drifting. Nick is trying to help and Luciana jumped in the water to swim back. Wow. 
Esse é o meu pickup. After sailing three weeks in the Sea of Cortes, we had to continue sailing south, despite our desire to see even more of this gorgeous region. We wanted to be in the south of Mexico by the end of May, so we would avoid being in hurricane-affected areas by the time hurricane season starts. We had a month and about 1,500 miles. It's time for breakfast. Nikki baked a banana bread with blueberries. And Alana wants to eat it all. We are gonna sail soon. We are in Frailes. It's a nice anchorage close to Los Cabos. We, are, we made a quick stop here because yesterday we had an emergency and we thought it would be smart to just stop to check our electricity, but we are gonna head, continue heading to Puerto Vallarta soon after banana bread though.